Hi there guys, this is Nikhil from Greedy Tech and in this video I am going to show you how you can use your Lee TV Lee 1S to control your TV or air conditioner with infrared blaster. So guys this is the Lee TV in front of us and to use the infrared blaster you need to use an app called as remote control. So this is the app and it comes pre-installed on your phone. So just open it up. Once you open it up this is pretty much the interface that you can see. If you are having a Lee TV connected to your home Wi-Fi and your phone is connected to the same router, your TV will show up over here. And just in case if you are not using a smart TV, you need to go over here. And now you need to press this plus button. So now you can choose a television, a conditioner, projector or a universal remote. Let's select TV. And now you need to select your TV brand. So I'll go with Panasonic. And now you need to turn off your display or turn off your television and point your phone to the television and press this button. And once you do that, just wait for 5 to 10 seconds and see if your TV turns on or not. So if it doesn't turn on, press not detected. So you basically have to try out all the remotes that this particular app has to offer. And if it gets detected, you need to press this button, control detected and select done. And now you'll see this beautiful remote. So these are your navigation buttons. These are your volume buttons. These are your channel buttons. And this is for home and back just in case if it is a smart television and that's pretty much it. So guys just in case if no remote works for you, you can send them a feedback with your model number and they'll try to fix the app. As of now this app or the infrared blaster on this device is supported by only this application. There's actually a very nice app called as Anymote Smart IR Remote and this is how it looks. But this app doesn't recognize the infrared blaster on your device. Maybe after a few days. So additional support will be added for this device so till then we have to use this default remote controller app so that's pretty much it guys in this way we can use your infrared blaster to control any device in your home with an infrared sensor so if you have any doubts do let me know by commenting below this video and if you found this video to be helpful give me a thumbs up and share it with your friends and subscribe to my channel to see more videos just like this